Hey, peoples. What's going on? Hey, what's going on? Odin, you're still alive. Good for you. I'm so happy. <laughs> Hi, everybody. That's a weird way to start a stream. <laughs> You're alive. Yay. I mean, that I mean that is a good thing. We're all alive. We're all still here. Thank the good Lord we're all still here. How's everybody doing? How is everybody feeling on this lovely, I was going to say lovely Friday afternoon. It's not a lovely Friday afternoon. It's actually uh, cold and rainy. I think it just started snowing too. So it's uh, not really a nice Friday afternoon. It's kind of a miserable Friday afternoon, but hey, we're here. We're doing things. We're still alive. We're still living life, living the good life. You know what? We're here. <laughs> so I can say we're here. Hi, everybody. Hi, hi, hi. Hola. Hola. What's up, everybody? All right. As you can see, we got the family here. We got the family hanging out. Because it's Christmas time, it's time for family togetherness. And uh, yeah, we're going to do some stuff here together. So we're going to do uh, some uh, some Christmas builds. That's right. I found these uh, I found these little these little sets here at Target last week. Got a little Santa Claus, and we got a uh, we got a Christmas train. Yay! So that's what we're going to do. We're going to build these little little Christmas Lego kits. And we're going to have us a good time. And the family is going to join us while we do this. Uh, what are we going to start off with? I think we'll start off with the train. We'll save Santa for the grand finale. Because Santa, it's Santa. Save him for last. All righty. Yeah. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Oh, whoa, oh, as pieces try to get away from me. How dare you? How dare you? I just feel disrespected now. They tried to run away. And I just feel disrespected. Disrespect. Okay. Ah. Oh, my God. We have our instrucciones. Ahí que instrucciones. What are we doing here? What are we doing? A long page of things and stuff. All righty. Hey, stop trying to run away from me, pieces. Don't do that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Okay. All righty. Let's, let's, let's try to have some semblance of knolling here. Not really. We're not going to knoll anything. We're just going to try to flip everything around. At least everything's right side up because, as we know, Lego always falls stud side down. It's like toast. It always lands butter side down. Legos always land stud side down. You always got to flip them all over. Like 95% of them you have to flip over. Okay. Got some of these. I think these are going to be the wheels for the train. The wheels on the train go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the train go round and round, <sighs> all through the town. Okay, all right, and then we got it. Oh, right. Oh, can I bring a legacy tarn? No, this is not about tarn. We're doing Christmas stuff here. Is it about tarn? You want to see tarn? You can watch the review I put up yesterday. You can see all the tarn, all the tarn your heart desires. Ah. Oh. Mary M. Gomez. That almost works. Almost. Doesn't flow as well, though. <laughs> uh, oh, what are you getting mascot for Christmas? More fish heads. That's all he wants for Christmas is more fish heads. It's his favorite. It's his favorite thing in the world. All righty. What are we doing? Let's build this little Christmas train here. Oh, Christmas train. Oh, Christmas train. Da, 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 Christmas train. All righty. What are we doing here? And I think that's happening like that. So thusly, 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 yes. Okay. That's, we have some red pieces here. We have the piece of Reese's Pieces. You should dress mascot up for Christmas. They don't, they don't make Santa suits in this size. What if I could? <laughs> I know. I've looked. 
They don't make Santa suits in this size. <laughs> I don't want to just wrap him up in tinsel. I mean, come on. Yes, you know, yes, some dignity. Some dignity. We have to preserve it. We have to preserve what dignity he has. All right. So we've done that. Now we are doing more things. More things, you say? Yes, more things. More of those things. All righty. Come here. Come here. Oh, man. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to all those saying Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you as well. Hope you all have a blessed holiday. And if you don't celebrate anything this time of year, hey, have a happy Sunday. You know, hey, just have a good Sunday. <laughs> All right. So this is going right up against this, it looks like. Okay. We are building things. Structure. Stability. What do we do now? We are doing this. We are doing this. Oh, Fly McMarty. Yes. Yes. That is correct. That's okay. We'll see. <laughs> we don't. No, no, nobody needs any reminders of that. Okay. We, we, we're we're reminded of that enough as it is every year. So thank you. We don't. We don't need the reminder. <laughs> Appreciate the sentiments, but we don't need the reminder. This time of year is already hard enough. Okay, what are we doing here? We're doing this. Um, oh, what's up, Big John? Merry Christmas to you as well. Jasper, am I ready for Christmas? I am so ready for Christmas. I am so, so ready. Honestly, really and truly, I'm not as excited for Christmas as I used to be. <laughs> I feel like as you get older, like you get less and less excited for Christmas. It's just like, you know, okay, it's another day. Except, you know, we get we get presents. <laughs> get to hang out and get presents, you know. After a while, holidays just become another day. Uh, Eric, how is the family? The family is doing well, thank you for asking. Everybody's doing well. Everybody's doing good. I will be seeing them this weekend. Spending some good old time with the family. All right. So what is happening here? Have I done this correctly? I have not. I am skipping a step. I am skipping a step. How dare I skip a step? How dare I? Dare I say, how dare I skip steps? Oh. Raged, what's your favorite Transformers character? Galvatron. You know why? Because the world needs more Galvatron. <laughs> Mastermind isn't the same for one's birthday. It just becomes another day. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. I don't. I don't. I make no fuss about my birthday anymore. I'm just like, yeah, it's my birthday. Yeah, whatever. One year closer to death. <laughs> another year closer to death. You know, that's all it is. Just another day. And another reminder of your impending mortality. <laughs> I don't make any fuss about my birthday anymore. I don't even care if nobody says happy birthday to me. It's like, I mean, obviously, like Lori says happy birthday. My family does. But honestly, if nobody else does, I'm just like, oh, whatever. I don't care. Even, even, even my birthday is just like another day. I don't make a fuss over it. Oh. oh, Tristan, what's your favorite Transformers vehicle mode? Vehicle mode? Um, uh, I didn't know. Maybe uh, something along the lines of like a... Uh, uh, 
toaster. That's it, toaster. That's the word I was looking for, toaster. I know it's not a vehicle, but I'm going to call it one for now. There you go, toaster. Yay! We got the front part of the train there. Look at that. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. It's precious. It's precious. So precious. So freaking stinking precious. Okay. Now we're building some more parts here. <laughs> what are we doing? Uh, all righty. Halo, will you ever retire Dark of the Moon Megs and Wave for skits? No. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? Are you sick out your dome? No. Megs and Wave, they're family. They're family. They'll stay here. They're going to be here forever. They're just as much part of the family as mascot. They're not going anywhere. Megs and Wave will go nowhere. Nowhere, I say. Nowhere. All righty. We're doing things. We have that. We have to do this. We have to do this twice. We must do this again. Second verse is just like what? The first. That's right. You know. We all know. We all know what it's like. Uh, which movie version? Who's this? Jasper. Which movie version of Wheeljack do you like the most? Um, The one where he's Wheeljack. That's my favorite, absolute favorite. Love that one. Love it so much. My absolute favorite. Oh, uh, who is this? Up the Rodimus. Happy holidays and Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Okay, there we go. We have things. We're building things. And this is going to go click onto this. Boop. There we go. Yay, we're doing things. Look at this. Look at us. Look at look at us. Look at us. We're doing things. We're making friends and influencing people. That's what we do here. That's what we do here. Yes. Okay. So what am I doing? <laughs> we're doing this. And a yellow. Oh, Joshua's. You are cool and awesome. You are. You are. Which of the 12 primes is your favorite? Uh number seven. That one's my favorite, number seven. Okay, we're doing that. Jack Hawk, have you gotten the Ocular Max Streetwise yet? Yeah, I just got him in uh, yesterday. He just arrived yesterday. When I will review him, I'm not entirely sure. Um, cause I do have the legacy Leo prime. I want to get that done. That'll probably be Monday. Um, I just got in the fans toys, uh, Mirage and I really want to do that one. So I don't know. We might not get the street wise until like, I don't know if I'll get to them next week. Maybe like the following Monday after next week, you know, like the, the, the Monday after Monday, maybe we'll, we'll do that one. We'll do street wise. But right now I have some other things that are taking a bit higher priority, but he looks delicious. Streetwise looks delicious. I saw PR's review of him. And uh yeah, it looks 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 tasty. Looks tasty and delicious. Alrighty, so this one is going here. So let's just sit in there. As you can see, these are very simplistic builds. Just did a simple little thing, and I am most pleased. Oh, I forgot to put a piece on the uh there's stuff that's supposed to go up top here. Oh, I'll save that for later. We'll do that last. How about that? We'll do that last. Um, so what am I doing here? Boom and boom. Oh, who's a storm blazer? Just made it. Hope I didn't miss much, but seems like I have since Megatron and Shockwave are back with their red couch with a pink bag. Uh, we, I mean, we've we've done this so far. We're almost we're almost done with the little Christmas train, and then after this, we will build uh, Santa. We're gonna build a little Santa also. He's got a couple little Christmas builds. I saw his at Target. I thought they were precious, and I was like, "Hey, we can do a little Christmassy build. A little Christmassy build. Why not? Why not? Okay, these go on either side. Thusly." And thusly. There we go. And then this gets the top. Get on there. 
Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Again, such simple engineering, but yet effective. And as always, I am a fan of simple yet effective. You know why? Because I am simple. Maybe not so effective, but I am simple. So you know what? I can appreciate it. That's why I appreciate simplicity in all its forms. Because I myself am a simple creature. All right. So we have to put together the last part here. Uh, this. Oh, there's a couple of things I forgot to put on this. Oh, so we're doing this. Oh, oh, the train tipped over. Oh, oh no. Train wreck. Train wreck. The stream has turned into a train wreck. Literally. Literally. Let's come down here a little bit. There we go. Alrighty, and then we have a piece that goes right here as well. Oops, hey, you you go in your home. You go in your home. Okay, did I forget anything else? <laughs> I think these are just spare parts. As always, you get a couple spare parts. I think those are spares. And is that it? Is that it? I believe that is it. Cool, 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 cool. There you go. There it is. Ah. There it is. Our little Christmas train. There it is. Oh, Christmas train. Oh, Christmas train. Da 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 da. Christmas train. Oh, Christmas train. Oh, Christmas train. We run serpentine. Oh, Christmas train. It's lovely. It's lovely. It's a lovely thing we're doing here. Okay. <laughs> there we go. We got our little Christmas train. That is precious. Oh, so precious. That's going to go upstairs with the rest of the uh, little decorations I have upstairs. Yay. Alrighty. Christmas train. Back up here, Christmas train. We run serpentine here. There we go. There's Christmas train. Hang out with mascot. All right. So now. <laughs> uh, yes, Hasbro revealed their reissuing G1 Hound. Yeah. I mean, I already have a G1 Hound. So that is not something that I will be buying since I have an original. So I don't need to buy another one. But cool. Very nice for those who want that. Ah, uh, Frostbite. Can Legacy Tarn? No, Legacy Tarn cannot make an appearance. We are here talking about Christmas. We are talking about the Christmassy season. If you want to see Tarn, you can watch yesterday's review and you can see all the Tarn you wish. You can put it on loop. Get Tarn. They have 24 hours of Tarn. Just have 24 hours of Tarn. Okay, there we go. So we have, ah, those are his eyes. Ah, ah, there are eyeballs in here. Ah, it's creepy. It's not Christmas. It's Halloween. There are eyeballs rolling around in here. Ah! Okay, I'm, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're all fine. Everybody's fine. Oh, Fox, what is the next coming writer video on the channel? Well, you'll see tomorrow. No, won't you? Hmm. <laughs> ah, just some more buckles. That's all. I won't tell you which buckles, but just some more buckles. Nothing new. Uh, nothing new came out the past couple weeks for uh, for Geats, so that's actually actually a good thing because it gave me a chance to get caught up because I was a bit behind on my Geats reviews. So actually, that the fact that there was a break in merch for a couple weeks actually gave me the opportunity to uh, get caught up, and now I can actually say I finally reviewed all the Geats stuff that I have, and now I can just wait for the new stuff to come out and I can review it as it comes out. So that pleases me. That pleases me immensely. All righty. Again, let's just get some semblance of knowing here. Just a vague semblance of knowing. There we go. A little bit of Christopher knowing. There we go. Okay. All righty. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. All right. Tristan, how did you get turned early? I mentioned where I got him in the video. I got him from Robot Kingdom. You know, you guys should really watch the videos. You'd be surprised how much information is there. Really, you'd be surprised how much I actually say things in those videos and give you useful information. It's 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 usually all right there. It's usually all right there waiting for you. <laughs> all righty, we're gonna build Santa Claus. Oh.
Alrighty. Nova, are you going to see the new Transformers movie next year? Do you really think I'm not? Come on now. Come on now. Really? 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 Of course I'm going to go see it. <laughs> of course I am. Come on now. My body is ready. My body is ready for Rise of the Beasts. I'm ready to rise. I'm ready to rise with the beasts. See, even the movies have discovered the value of rising. See, see, it's not just see. I that's this is what I do here. I start trends. I start trends, and I evolve the business. You see, this is what I do here. See, I start talking about rising. All of a sudden, we got a movie called Rise of the Beast. Come on now, you think that's a coincidence? Do you think that's a coincidence? It probably is a coincidence, but still, I'm going to take credit for it. I don't care. I'm going to take credit for it, regardless. <laughs> I will take all the credit regardless of how much I don't deserve it. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Vendetta, thoughts on King Oger? Um, It sure does look like a Super Sentai series. I don't know. I mean, the suits look cool. The suits look cool. Um... And that's pretty much it. I didn't read. They already released like the story details, but I didn't read that because honestly, I don't. I don't like reading. That's spoilers to me, so I don't like reading that stuff. I just want to watch the show and let the show tell me what the story is going to be. I don't like reading that stuff ahead of time. But um, you know that that promo poster that they put out. I mean, the, the suits look cool. Um, they did just release like a, a better look at the, uh, the the mecha. The mecha looks really cool. I hope they they. Um, I, I, I hope the, the, the toy has that same amount of articulation that they gave on Itaijin because that would be great. I hope that that's a trend that they're going to continue with having some really good, like, nicely articulated uh, Sentai mech. I hope that'll be the case with King Oger. But yeah, yeah I, mean, I mean, you know, again, I, 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 I can't say much just based on, you know, a picture. I mean, like I said, the suits, the suits look cool. The, uh, the Megazord looks cool. I know it's not a Megazord, but yeah, just give it, just to put the general term on it. But um, yeah, can't wait to see how that turns out. Cannot wait to see how that turns out. Hopefully, it will be good. Hopefully, it will be entertaining. And that's all I ask. That is all I ask. Of these series just entertain me. Entertain me. Okay, we're building Santa Claus here, by the way, in case anybody's just joining us. We're building Santa Claus. We're building Santa Claus. There we go. Alrighty. I have no idea what I'm building of him. I don't know what part of this is. What what part what part of this is? What part of what part this is of what did uh, words, things, sentences. I try. Words, I use them. Not always successfully, but I use them. Anyway. <laughs> What are we doing here? I need two of these things. The Santa build will rise. Exactly. Exactly. Jasper, did you see my question? Uh, apparently not. What, Jasper, we need to see more mascot singing? Is that is that your question? I mean, that's not a question. But I, I did see that. Oh, uh, Mike, have you seen Bat Wheels? No, I have not. What is that? What is that? Bat? What is Bat Wheels? What is this thing you speak of? What are we doing here? Oh, these are going to be his, uh, his, his skiing poles. Made two of these. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Mike, have you seen South Park? Yeah, I used to watch South Park all the time. I don't, I don't watch it as much anymore. Like sometimes I will watch an episode here and there if I catch it, but um, I, I don't watch, I don't watch South Park as much as I used to. But I did watch it a lot back. I watched it religiously back in the day, like when it first came out. Okay, what are we doing here? We're doing that, and then we are doing. I think we're. Are we building his belly? I think we're building his belly. 
that will shake like a bowl full of jelly. Ah, uh, Trung, Trung Fam. I'm sorry if I'm uh, messing up your name. What is your favorite Transformers figure from Takara? We're being specific here. From Takara? Um, I don't know. I mean, Takara's put out a lot. I mean, you're, you, that's, that's a pretty broad question because Takara's put out a lot of stuff. So that's a pretty broad question. We're talking about years and years worth of figures here. Um, I mean, off the top of my head, I mean, I love MP44, so I'll go with that. Favorite Geats writer currently? Uh, favorite Geats writer? Um, huh. I would say Buffa, just because I like the suit design. I, I think I think Buffa is like my favorite suit design. I think it looks cool. Um, like character wise, I like Tycoon because his character has a bit more depth to him. Geats doesn't have that much depth to him. Geats is just like, hey, I'm the kind of snarky guy and I'm going to win. I'm always going to win because I'm a winner because me, I win. And, you know, it's like there's, it's, it's pretty one dimensional. It's just like, okay, not a whole lot of nuance there. I like Tycoon because there's a bit more nuance to his character, it's a bit more depth there. Um, Geats kind of falls a little flat in terms of personality because <laughs> he's just constantly like, I'm going to win because I'm the best and I'm going to win because you're not going to win because you're not me and I'm the best. And if you're not me, then you're not going to win because you're not the best like I am. That's pretty much like 95% of his dialogue. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, no. <laughs> Uh, Moby Dick, how about a robot that transforms into Santa's Christmas sleigh? I, I would, you know what? I'd be all for that. I would be all for that. I would buy their entire stock. I would buy their absolute entire stock. I'm here for it. I'm a fan. <laughs> okay. So we are doing two of these. <laughs> Mike, can you sing the South Park theme song in Shockwave's voice? <laughs> oh, we're going down to South Park, going to have ourselves a time. Friendly faces everywhere, humble folks without temptation. That's as much as I'm going to do. Oh, what are your thoughts on Kamen Rider Glare so far? Which one's Glare? Is that the new one? Is that the guy with the uh, with the new driver? Is that, is that his name, Glare? I didn't know what his name was. Because he never said what his name was. Um, but yeah, so, I mean, suit design looks cool. Uh, what are we building here? What is this? Oh, this is his, oh, this is his butt. That's his butt. This is his back of his butt that we built. His back and his butt. Back butt. Back but back but that's what we built i thought it was his belly i thought that was his belly it's his butt which also jiggles like a bowl full of jelly oddly enough anyway. <laughs> ryan patron what's your favorite writer suit design any show any writer my favorite suit design in general i think is wizard i love wizard suit i think it just looks cool okay what are we doing now i'm totally losing track of where i am what i'm doing where am I? Where am I? And where's my soup? Those are the questions that need to be answered. Okay, we're here. Okay, this is what we're doing. Right. Ah, don't you day. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so this is getting stacked up here. Boom. Boom. Are you getting the vision driver? I don't know. I don't know. I can't give you a definitive answer on that. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I'm not sure yet. That is one of those up in the air things. We'll see. We'll see what happens is all I can tell you as far as the vision driver goes. I cannot give you a concrete yes or no because I'm not sure. I don't know. We'll see what happens. 
Okay, so we've done this, and now all this is getting dropped upon this. There we go. We're building a body. We have a body. It's a body. It's a body. Okay. Now we're building his sack of presence, of presence, of presence, presence. I have to make sure I finish that sentence. Okay, so we're doing this. We... <laughs> Oh, uh, hey, Mgo, how did you do Prime Soundwave's voice? I mean, I, 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 I can't explain how to do a voice. It's just uh, I just I just do it. It's just like this. This is what you know. This is how I make Prime Soundwave talk. It's like, hey, I'm Prime Soundwave. I, I can't explain how I do it. It's just kind of like you just kind of like close your throat up and just I don't know. It's it's not one of those things that's easy to explain. I'm not. I just I just do it. I just do it. You know, I went to Lord Megatron and he was like, Hey, Soundwave. And I was like, Hey, Lord Megatron, did you see what the Ravage did? He filled your quarters full of duty. You know, it's just stuff like that. Stuff like that. I don't know. And <laughs> uh, uh, oh, McMarty, what do you think is the most annoying Christmas song ever? I'm not really annoyed by any Christmas songs. I mean, I don't mind Christmas music, so I don't really particularly find any of them annoying. I'm sure some of you do. <laughs> I don't really. Okay, what are we doing here? That's, and then the yellow one goes up top. And here we go. So this is getting clipped back here, and there he has his Sack of presents. Yay for a sack of presents. Uh, his mascot, Carson, is mascot a Lego Bionicle? Yes, he is. He is indeed a Lego Bionicle. You are correct, sir, in that assumption. You win the prize. And the prize is, well, it's nothing. But, you know, hey, you, you get to know that you know something. The prize is knowing that you have knowledge. There you go. There's your prize. It's a prize, a gift that keeps on giving. What days of the week do you rise the most, Dante? I rise every day of the week. I rise every day. There, there isn't a day that I don't rise. I stay rising so I don't have to rise. That's the way it works. Hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> What are we doing here? We're building his face. This is his face. We're building his face. He has eyes. It's creepy, lifeless eyes. No, I'm kidding. I guess you could legit make him angry if you want. You can make him angry, Santa, if you wanted to. But they want him like this. So he looks happy. He looks like he's having fun. <laughs> All righty. So that's going to be his mustache, I guess. And... We have to make a, uh, we have to make his hat, which comprises of this and this and a this. Um, go. have you ever noticed that your shockwave voice sounds like Doc Brown? No, it doesn't. It does not sound like Doc Brown. I think it's more so the case Doc Brown sounds like shockwave. I think that's really what it is. Now, Doc Brown's voice is deeper. <clears throat> Christopher Lloyd has a has a deeper voice. It's, it is kind of a similar tone, but his voice is deeper. There we go. There's Santa's face. <laughs> uh, did I forget something? Because I feel like I have way too many extra parts. <laughs> did I miss something? I may have missed something. I don't know, but we'll see. Where is it supposed to go? Where does Santa's face go? I think it's supposed to go right here. Nope. Where's it going? Oh, it goes right there. Nope. Where's it going? Santa, where is your face going, Santa? There you go. That's where his face is going. Ah, okay. That's where Santa's face is going. Oh, Santa face. Oh, Santa face. Da 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 da. Santa face. Magnus, why don't you review copywriter movie stuff? Um, I do once in a blue moon. Um. 
But again, it all just boils down to a lot of movie stuff. Here's here's the thing. A lot of movie stuff, they release as premium Bandai items. And premium Bandai items, majority of the time, are just regular DX toys repainted with some extra noises. And they're, they're like, okay, this is worth like an extra 50 bucks now. And I don't go in on that. I'm just like, you know what? Not worth it to me. So that's why I don't review a lot of the premium Bandai stuff. Because I refuse to pay an upcharge for regular DX, re, for repainted DX toys, you know, which is a lot of it is. Um, I didn't get the, you know, a, a lot of people ask me about the Libera driver from uh, Revice. I didn't get that out of principle, just because I don't know why they made that driver a premium Bandai item. Like, she was one of the main writers. Why are you making one of the main writers drivers an exclusive? That should have been a regular release. So I didn't buy that out of principle. <laughs> because that should have really just been a regular release. Not a premium Bandai. Like the, 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 the Demon's Driver, okay. I could see the Demon's Driver being a premium Bandai. But not the Libera Driver. Not that one. That made no sense to me. But whatever. But that's why I don't go in on a lot of premium Bandai stuff. It has to be something I really, really want and I feel is worth the money. And that doesn't happen too often. Like the Demon's Driver, honestly, the like the Demon's Driver, like, yeah, I wanted that. I thought it was cool. I love the noises it makes and everything. I love the voice. So I was like, yeah, I'll get the Demon's Driver. I'll, 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 I'll pony up the money for the Demon's Driver. But the Libera Driver, I just I didn't buy that out of principle because that should not have been an exclusive. <laughs> B man, you just got here. Well, here you are. Here you are. You are here indeed. Why did I get Lori for Christmas? Ah, uh, stuff, things, and stuff. What's your dream car? A uh, Batmobile. A Batmobile. I want a Batmobile. Okay. I don't think I, I don't, I don't think I forgot anything. I just feel like I did. I feel like I missed a piece somewhere, but no, it seems like I'm looking at the picture. It seems like I got it all right. Actually, I think his head, actually, no, I have his head too high up. His head is supposed to be like down here. Like he's like really hunkering down into that slope. There we go. See, there we go. Like he's really hunkering down into that slope. I don't think I missed anything. It just seems like, I guess these are all just spare parts, but I don't think I missed anything. There you go. We built Santa. We built us little Santa Claus with, ah, there you go. That's what happens when you go skiing, Santa. That's what happens, buddy. Sometimes you wipe out. There you go. We got Santa. We got Santa Claus. We got Santa Claus. There we go. There we go. We got Santa. We got a little. Christmas train, oh Christmas train, da 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 da, Christmas train. Woo. Don't hit Santa. How dare you? There we go. There's little Santa Claus, skiing Santa Claus, ready to deliver his gifts. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Lovely, wonderful, marvelous, fabulous. It only took what? Thirty-eight minutes, <laughs> and it only took that long because I was talking to you guys. I'm getting distracted. Probably would have gotten this done even faster, but there you go. We got a little, our little Christmas builds all done. Yay. These will go upstairs with the other decorations. These are adorable. These are precious. There you go. Oh, man. Mike, favorite South Park character? Um... Probably Butters. I like Butters. It's Butters. That's me. There you go. Very nice. Very nice little Christmas beards. Yay. 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 There we go. <laughs> and if you really want to, if you want to, we can do this. We can totally do this. We can make him. <laughs> we, can, we can make him angry, Santa. That's when you've been naughty. That's when you've been naughty. Don't do that. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, for all somebody, I think Tarden would like to help with the next build. No, Tarden's busy doing his own stuff, man. He's he's busy with his own business. He's got that DJD business to handle. He ain't got time for building. He only has time for justice. That's what he has time for. Oh, man. There we go. There we go. He's happy again. Yay. This eye's a little crooked, but it's okay. Uh, who remembers Dude Where's My Couch and and Special Good Time Man and then Dinodri? Yes. Y'all remember Dude Where's My Couch. It's a classic. It's a classic. Favorite Christmas movie. A Christmas story. Ah, he lost his back. A Christmas story. Love a Christmas story. And on Christmas, we'll have 24 hours of a Christmas story. <laughs> you shoot your eye out, kid. Love that movie. Love that movie. That is my absolute favorite Christmas movie. It is not Christmas unless you watch a Christmas story. You just have to. It is just... It is just, uh, it's, it's, it's mandatory viewing on Christmas, as far as I'm concerned, anyway. You got to watch a Christmas story. Let's raise up a little bit so we can see everybody. There we go. There we go. It's happy. And the cats are running around. The cats feel like doing laps now. It's okay. They like to get their exercise in. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Grimlock needs a new case. Well, for me, Grimlock, Grimlock, and Grimlock. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Who's your favorite? Who's your favorite writer? You wrote your writer. I'm assuming you mean writer. Who's your favorite writer in Saber? Uh, Saber. I like Saber. I like his suit design. I thought it was just overall cool. <laughs> Who's this? Ga Gara? Gara7? I'm sorry if I'm butchering your name. I own several Grimlocks purely because of that video. <laughs> me, Grimlock, Grimlock. And, see, you need at least three, right? So you have me, Grimlock, Grimlock, and Grimlock. You should bring the Dinogers back. Oh, I don't know. Maybe that'll happen someday. Maybe it won't. I don't know. I can't tell you. Who knows what the future will bring? Who knows? Who knows? Uh, Fly McMarty, are you down with OPP? What do you mean, other people's primes? No, I'm only down with my primes. Only my primes supply. <sighs> Mascot needs a talk show. <laughs> You know what? That was, believe it or not, that was actually an idea for a while. That was actually an idea. It never happened, but that actually was an idea that I had. Uh -huh. B-Man, I'm having bagel sliders and kettle corn for lunch. Cool. Enjoy. Enjoy your bagel sliders and kettle corn. Who is, uh, I'm going to butcher your name. I'm so sorry. The Bur, the Burgund, Burgundian Jinx. I'm so sorry <laughs> if I'm butchering your name. I have a question. What would you say for the worst? What would you say for the worst ever toy line that Hasbro ever produced for Transformers? My least favorite was those Power Core Combiners. I was not a fan of those Power Core Combiners. Now, granted, the last couple of ones they did, like they, they did a Dinobot set, which was actually it was actually decent. And I think they did a constructor concept, which was also actually decent, but the rest of them were just not good. They were just, they were not good. <laughs> so yeah, those power core combiners were like, <clears throat> did not care for that line. Did not care for them. I ended up getting rid of them all. I didn't even keep the ones I liked. I, got, I just got rid of them all. <laughs> uh, to make space. Oh man. <laughs> Make one episode of Mascot Talk Show just to see what it would be like. <laughs> hey, who knows? It may happen. Like I said, that it was an idea at one point. So who knows? Maybe someday it will happen. Who knows? I would have to buy like a desk and everything. And I, I would have to get like the whole setup, like a desk and everything. Little chairs on the side, you know, get a whole like Tonight Show setup going on. You know, 
that would be some uh some 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 accessory hunting I would need to do in order to make that work. Oh, uh, fire hearts. It's better to keep stuff you like than keep stuff you don't like. Exactly. 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 Sebastian, I used to think mascot was the fallen. <laughs> he does kind of bear a resemblance. I could see how I could see how that could happen. <laughs> oh. I'm just going to call you Jinx, okay? Because I, I I don't want to risk messing up the rest of your name. I can pronounce Jinx, though. Are you ever planning to review GoBots? Um, I reviewed some. I reviewed the Action Toys uh, Machine Robo series. I've been reviewing a lot of those, which are, you know, technically GoBots. I know Machine Robo and GoBots are two different shows, but, you know, the, the designs are the same. And let's face it, when you see them, you go, GoBots. So, you know. <laughs> but... I have, I do have, I have a playlist. So if you go on the channel, just look up the um, Machine Robo slash GoBots playlist. And you can see all that I've done there. Andrew, use the table and chair from Toy World Barricade. No, that's way too small. Way too small. Well, that table and chair is like this big. That thing, dang, 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 dang. we have to add something that's actually like proportional here. You know, like these, you know, like the couch here. We need like a desk that's actually more proportional for mascot. You know, that desk was like that desk is tiny. I ain't, I ain't. That's not mascot sized. Jasper, did they ever release all the third party Predaking? Uh, which one? There's quite a few third-party Predakings. Um, the Kang Toys one is not complete yet. They still have one more member to put out. Um, I'm assuming that's probably the one you're talking about. But as far as the Kang Toys set, no, there's still one more to go. Uh, Fireheart, where did you get the couch for Megatron and Shockwave? That is a Barbie couch. <laughs> that came from a little Barbie set that I saw. I saw it. Where did I see it? I saw it at Walmart. I saw it at Walmart and I saw this couch. I was like, that could be a cool little accessory just to have, like, just to do skits with. But I didn't want it to be pink. So I was like, you know what? I just got some spray paint. I was like, shh, I just sprayed it red. So, you know, fit the motif of the channel. And the rest, as they say, is history. The Autobot Nation, do you have any grandkids? I don't even have kids, let alone grandkids. So yeah. <laughs> you have to have children before you have grandchildren, and I don't have any of those. Everybody hydrate, by the way. Hydration break. Hydration break. Mm. Hydrate. <laughs> Ah, uh, V said, we're MGOs, kids. That's right. You were all, you were all my children now. As Freddie once said, you are all my children now. Uh, Carson, can you do more mascot reviews? Um, when the inspiration strikes, I will. It's not just something I can just do. Um, mascot reviews take a spark of inspiration that doesn't happen very often. That's why mascot reviews don't happen very often. But um, the next time that spark of inspiration hits, it will be another one. Um, but I don't know when that will be. <laughs> That's just a let nature take its course kind of deal. <laughs> v said, where's my allowance? You don't get your allowance until you do your chores, man. When you finish your chores, you'll get your allowance. What are your chores? You'll have to figure that out for yourself. If you don't know, then I'm not going to tell you. You should already know what your chores are. You know what you're supposed to be doing. You're supposed to be a responsible adult. You should know what you'll be doing. I should know how to speak sentences. I don't always do that well either, but you know what? We, we keep going. We go with it. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh. 
Stormblazer. I'm noticing mascot has a long neck with a short body. Are you are you neck shaming mascot? How dare you? How dare you neck shame mascot? His neck is perfectly proportioned to his body. How dare you? How dare you? That is just disrespectful. Disrespect. Anyway. <laughs> oh man. Oh, Max FX. Hey, Mgo, have you had any interest in the Legacy Gen Selects line? All the die core repaints and such. No, none of that stuff is interesting. None of that stuff is interesting me. We get enough repaints in the main line. I'm not I'm not getting exclusive repaints unless they're characters. Ooh, excuse me. Unless they're characters that I actually like. But I'm not getting some random diaclone repaint. This is I don't care. B Man, did you know that Twitch from the Ellen show died? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard about that. I actually I actually never watched Ellen. Like Lori told me about it. I'm like, who's that? Lori was like, Twitch died. I'm like, who's Twitch? Like, From the Ellen show. I was like, oh, I've never watched it. So I don't know. But yeah, that, I mean, that sucks. Right? My condolences. My condolences to his family. May he rest in peace. Oh, uh, Fox. What are, what, blah, blah, blah. reading? I can do it. I swear. What writer figure arts are you going to get? Um, if I can get if I can get my hands on it, I'll probably get that Geats figure art that they're putting out. I'll probably get it because um, it looks tasty. So I might get Geats. I know they announced some other ones, so I think they just announced Buffer. I might get Buffer. Again, it all depends on how easy they are to get because sometimes figure arts are not easy to get because sometimes they will sell out like that. And then it's like eBay where you have to pay like double the price and, you know. You know how it is. You know. You know how it is. Uh. Uh. So has Mascot ever been mistaken for an alien by backwoods country folk? Oh, all the time. All the time. Who is this? If I could 3D print a setup for mascot, would you consider making one video of mascot stock show? I mean, I don't think it would really be all that hard to like find a desk. I could probably literally just go to the Barbie section and probably find a desk. I found a couch, so I could probably find a, you know, I'm sure there's like office Barbie that comes with a desk or something, and I could, you know. <laughs> so honestly, I don't think a desk for mascot would be really all that hard to find. Uh, is the couch logical? The couch is the most logical. The most logical. Which store do you think has the worst stock for Transformers? I think it's Walmart. Uh, yeah. Well, at least, I mean, definitely my Walmart. The Walmart in my area sucks. Like, once in a blue moon, you actually see something new there, and I'm just like, wow, it's a miracle. Um, Target is a bit better about stocking new stuff, not by much, but they're a bit better <laughs> at stocking the new stuff when it comes out. Black Hero, best Brooklyn Nine-Nine funny moments. I've never watched that, so I don't know. Uh, Rampager, have any interest in the Bowser Lego set? Uh, it looks cool, but I don't know if I really want it. Mike, can you say, oh my God, they killed Kenny and Shockwave. But you can say it. You say it. How about you say it? <laughs> this is the part where people are like, dance, monkey, dance. <laughs> dance for our amusement. Oh, man. Are you getting the DX Powered Builder and Gigant Buckle set? I mean, if they're regular releases, sure. I mean, as far as like this regular release DX stuff, yes, I'll get it. The premium Bandai stuff is the stuff that like, that's up in the air. But if it's a regular mainline release, yes, I'll get it. But premium Bandai stuff is what I'm picky and choosy about. It is? Okay. Well, yeah, then I'll get it. <clears throat> yeah. 
anything that's just coming out on the main line, yes, I'll pick up. But like like I said, the premium Bandai stuff is what I'm I'm choosy with. But all the all the regular DX stuff I'll pick up. Uh the Autobot Nation, do you have Studio Series Shockwave? Yes, I do. I reviewed him a long time ago. Uh, cars. Hi, Emgo. Do you ever buy Toy Hacks labels? Yes, I do. I do buy Toy Hacks labels. I love Toy Hacks stuff. There's actually a couple sets that I still want to buy. The last set I bought, I bought all the sets they put out for the uh, HasLab Unicron. And that took forever to put all the stickers on. It's a lot of stickers. But I put those things on Unicron. And he looks so much better. He looks so cool. I did get the Maw stickers, even though even though when I reviewed him, I said I don't, you know, the unpainted Maw didn't bother me, which it doesn't. The unpainted Maw on Unicron didn't bother me one bit. But when I saw those stickers, I was like, that does look really good, though. I think I'm gonna get that. <laughs> so, even though it didn't bother me anyway, I still got the sticker set for the Maw and for the rings and everything. Like, yeah, he looks he looks cool. Uh, Mr. Cool Guy, thoughts on King Oger? Um, I talked about this earlier, but yeah, I mean, you know, I uh, as far as the suits go, the suits look cool. The mecha looks cool. Um, I didn't read any of the story details because I don't like reading that stuff ahead of time because that's you know that's, that's I'm, I consider that spoilers. So I just like to watch the show and let the show tell me what the story is. So you know, um, but you know, from what I saw from that you know one picture, looks cool. <laughs> How about Friends? I love Friends. I watched all the Friends. Fly McMarty, what's the whole deal with saving juice? <laughs> that was just a dumb joke. When I reviewed, um, was it the MP? It was It was a version of Inferno. I, will, I forget what version of Inferno. But, you know, I was talking about, you know, the spout at the end of the ladder that shoots, you know, whatever to put out the fire. I was like, you know, it shoots, uh, you know, it shoots saving juice, you know. And then I think the official MP came with the uh, actual, like, effect part. And I was like, look, it's the saving juice. <laughs> he actually has the saving juice, you know. So that's what it was, just a stupid joke. To describe, you know, the, you know, how they put out fires with saving juice, you know. You know, it is. Uh, OC Cola is it crazy that I found a studio series Optimus Prime at, a, at the flea market missing some stuff hey cool cool find have you read the Kamen Rider Zero One comic no I have not Frostbite I think Tarn would like to be on mascot show I have a feeling you like Tarn am I correct in that assumption I think you like Tarn <laughs> Storm Blazer, do you know if the 500k special will be here soon? No, it will not be here soon. I'm still working on it whenever I can. I'm so sorry. I don't think that'll be here anytime soon. That might, it might end up being the 600,000 special, to be perfectly honest. And I'm sorry. It's just that I just I don't have a lot of time to work on it. Odin, what's happening? What? Odin, what do you want, Odin? What's happening? What's happening? Lori's not here. Lori's at work right now. So Lori is working folk right now. She working. She doing them hours. She putting them hours in. Making that money. Making that Christmas money. Uh, ah, Super Emin. That is a good question. Odin, have you bought all the things for Misty yet? That is a good question. That is a question I would like the answer to as well. Have you bought all the things for Misty? I hope so. You know why? You should. You should. You know why? Because you love her. So you buy her all the things. All the things she wants. Oh my god, Moby Nick. That is a very hard question. Who is your most favorite and least favorite Transformers to review this year? I have no... I don't even remember what all I reviewed this year. So I can't answer that question. I know I reviewed some not good stuff. I reviewed some really good stuff. What they are specifically, pfft, your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> uh -huh. 
Oh, Bendo, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Words. They're, they're, they're escaping me today. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to you as well. Oh, man. H, you have a lot of letters and numbers. What? H M O T 4 K 4 K. Ah, whatever. Happy holidays, M Go. Would you do a Kamen Rider cosplay for the season? I don't have any Kamen Rider cosplay. I don't even have a helmet or anything. I want a Kamen Rider helmet. I know there are some people who like make Kamen Rider helmets, but they're always like on Facebook and stuff, and I'm not on Facebook. So I wish there were just some like just sites like Etsy or something. I know I know there are some sellers on Etsy that do sell like like they they sell like um the files to like 3D prints a writer helmet. But I don't have a 3D printer so that doesn't help me. And a lot of the helmets that I do see that people are selling on there like don't look good. They look kind of crappy and they want a lot of money for them and I'm not paying a lot of money for a crappy looking helmet. <laughs> so, you know. <laughs> Oh, Fox, what are your favorite buckles uh, from Geats? My favorite buckles. Um, that's my thinking noise. I fart when I think. But, um, my favorite buckle. <laughs> Um, I do like the, uh, the, the, the gold one. I forgot what it's called already. The gold one, the jackpot one. I forgot what it's called already. <clears throat> uh... Are you collecting all the Power Ranger helmets? Yes, I am. I actually just got the Blue Ranger helmet in. The Pink Ranger helmet, I'm waiting. <laughs> they, the Pink Ranger helmet, those have been sitting at GameStop for like ever. I'm just waiting for them to drop the price on them. <laughs> I'm waiting for those things to go on clearance so I can get it cheap and not pay 100 bucks for it. And I will get the Pink Ranger helmet. I do have the, the Lord Dracon helmet. That is in my pile of loot uh, at BBTS. I haven't shipped that out yet, but I do have the Lord Dracon helmet in my pile of loot. So yeah, I actually never, Fever Slot, thank you so much. I totally forgot the Fever Slot buckle, yeah. I like that one. Um, I totally regret that I didn't pick up the White Ranger helmet when I had the chance, and now on eBay, people want like 300 bucks for it. So I'm kind of like, man, that's one of those things I should have picked up when I had the chance. Oh... Big John, do you ever think you'll retire from YouTube? I mean, eventually. It'll happen. <laughs> I mean, you know, nothing lasts forever. But I'll, I will ride this for as long as I can. As long as they'll let me. As long as you guys will let me. As long as you guys are watching. As long as this is, uh, you know, financially viable also. Because, you know, this, it, it costs a lot of money to keep this channel running. So if the money ain't coming in, then I can't really do this. So, you know, that factors into things too. Um, was this Moby Nick Pink Ranger helmet for $60 on toy, to, toy snowman, but might be sold out. Is that toy snowman. Is that a site? Toy snowman. I'll have to look that up. Oh, Black Hero, Friends' favorite character. My favorite character from Friends would be, I guess, Chandler. Oh, gotta go and go, Senpai. See you later. Have a happy doll. Have a, I can't read today. Have a happy holidays. Thank you for being here. Enjoy your day. Enjoy your weekend. Happy holidays to you as well. Enjoy. Enjoy. I was correct. Your favorite character is Tarn. I, I thought so. I had I had I had a feeling. I had a gut feeling. It was a hunch. Uh, 
Oh, what do you think about O's Tajadol entity form? It was cool. Cool. Amy, play Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. Nah, I don't play Five Nights at Freddy's. I played the first one for a little bit, got bored with it. I was like, ah, I'm over it. <laughs> All those games are the same. Oh. Cat Jazz, the more videos you make, the more I will watch because, well, let us be honest, you're worth watching. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Odin, she loves me. She really loves me. She does love you. She loves you. She loves you so much. She might love me a little more, though, but she loves you also. Also, almost as equally. Almost as equally. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, man. Hydration break, everybody. Let's hydrate. Maybe it'll help me speak more coherently. Although I doubt it. <clears throat> oh, Merry Christmas to you as well, Odin. To you and Misty and all of your family. May you all have a happy, blessed holiday. Hope Santa brings you everything you asked for. Ah, <laughs> oh, hydrates. Oh, sweet hydration. What does Lori do for work? Uh, she works retail. I won't say where, but she works retail. So this is a great time of year because it's super busy. And when she comes home from work, she has, oh, so many stories <laughs> to share. <laughs> oh man max i want to thank you for streaming today i've been sick and self-isolating and i've been dealing with a lot recently you're really cheering me up today thanks Sam. go merry christmas oh thank you i hope you get better get well get well so we want you to get well get well get well so we want you to get well it's a splendid little anthem of wellness yes oh uh, Oh, have you gotten in yet the X-Trans bots James Bond yet? No, I have not gotten that. Is that even out already? Is that out yet? Uh, Rampager, did you end up getting more boost bikes with the blank pants? No, because everywhere is sold out of it. <laughs> The last time I ordered something, I was like, oh, let me just throw in another another boost striker. And everybody sold out of boost strikers. So apparently Bandai is going to be releasing some packs that have like the blank bodies. Um, so I'll just have to go in on that. Which I guess is more makes wait, it's just probably the better way to go than just having a bunch of boost strikers, you know. But at the mo at the time I said that I didn't know that they were releasing those packs with the accessories and the blank bodies. I didn't know that was a thing yet, so that's why I was like, maybe I just gotta buy some more boost strikers. But now I know I don't really have to do that. But we'll see how easy it is to get a hold of those those uh, accessory sets with the blank bodies, though. That's the thing. How easy will those be to get? I don't know. Uh, can you show off all your buckles on stream? I mean, they're over, they're over there. I can, I don't know if I can, if I can move the camera and not cut the stream out. They're over, they're over there. Can you see? There we go. That's the, that's the writer shelf right there. That's the, that's the current Geats shelf right there. And there are the buckles in the, in the, there's the monster. There's some other one. There's, there's some things there. There's the boost striker. That's the boost striker right there. There's the phone. There's Tycoon and Geats. Buffa, you can't really see Buffa. Like Buffa's the <laughs> Buffa's upper torso, since he doesn't have legs. I don't have legs for him. So his upper torso I just have sitting on the boost striker. <laughs> and it looks kind of sad, honestly. But I don't have legs for him. So I just I have no way to display him right now. Uh -huh. 
Big John, are you going to review more 5-2 toys? Um, yeah, eventually. I don't have any new ones at the moment, but yeah. I'm sure eventually I'll get some more. Take a look at them. Carson, do you collect Funko Pops? I do have some Funko Pops. I do. Frostbite, so we'll turn up your mascot stock show. I don't know. I cannot answer that. I don't know. Who knows what the future will bring? Um, <clears throat> Maggots. How do old Megs and Shock and their how do old Megs and Shockwave and their couch hold up after all these years? I remember when I was like super young. <laughs> They're holding up perfectly fine. They're doing well. What do you think of Creo Transformers? Uh, they were fine for what they were. They weren't bad. They were okay. They were fun to put together. Jasper, I don't know if I want X-Transbots, James American, or Bond Japanese. Which version would you get? Um, I forget which one I pre-ordered. I think I, I think I pre-ordered like the, the 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 like the G1 toy colored version. I think that was the one I pre-ordered. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. No, don't quote me on that. No, ch no channel. How did you get Tarn early? I mentioned it in the video. I got him from Robot Kingdom. You guys should really watch the videos. You'd be surprised how much information is actually there. I usually tell you guys like stuff, like where to get things and where I got things. I usually put that information out there for you guys. The information is there. Just, just you know, be there for it. <laughs> It's amazing how video reviews actually have information in them, you know? It's crazy. Uh, uh, Jasper, did you get snow? We were getting, actually, just as Lori was going, uh, leaving for work, it was already snowing. I don't know if it still is because I'm down here in the basement, so I don't know. I have no access to a window right now, so I don't know if it's still snowing, but it was when she left for work. Moby Nick, have you been working out? I have. I have. <laughs> Ultra Spider-Man, how did you get the voice of mascot? What are you guys talking about? Mascot does his own voice. Nobody speaks for him. He speaks for himself. He is an independent individual with his own thoughts and feelings, and he speaks his own words from his own mind. What is your favorite weapon from Geats? Um... I do like the... Um... The uh, wow, I can't remember the name of anything. The one that just came out, the sword with the two buckles. I can't remember any what anything's called right now. The sword with the two buckles, the command, command, the, the, the command twin buckles that that's it. And the sword, I like that. There we go. It came to me. It came to me. Uh... Oh, have you been working out? Yeah, out of the basement. <laughs> I mean, yes, I do work out of my basement. I actually do work out in my basement. <laughs> this is where, this is, I actually do have like my weights and bench down here. So this is actually where I do work out. I do work out in the basement. <laughs> so that's not really inaccurate either. <laughs> but yes, I work out of my basement and I do work out in my basement. So either way, it is correct. <laughs> It's not really a joke. Not really a joke. It is correct. Amy Rose, can you react to Bloody Bunny, the first blood? I have no idea what you're talking about. I've never heard of that. That's new to me. Uh, an average cassette player, do you remember where Megs and Shockwave's couch came from? Yes, it's a Barbie couch. It's a Barbie couch I found at Walmart years ago. It was originally pink, and then I painted it red, and the rest is history. Uh, 
Moby Nick, can you do your impressions of Waspinator and Dinobot? Dance, monkey, dance. <laughs> okay, I'll do it this one time. Waspinator, Waspinator wants to talk to Dinobots. What do you want? There you go. That's all you get. <laughs> That's all you get for free. The rest will cost you. <laughs> Uh, what is your favorite character from Transformers G1? It would be Galvatron. How much money have you spent on burritos? I've lost count, man. I have lost count. I don't even know. That's just... It would take accountants years to figure that number out. <laughs> uh -huh. Sad gamer, yes, I remember you. The only thing you ever say in my comments is first. I wish you would stop doing that and actually contribute to the conversation. Because <laughs> all you ever say is first. Like, can you please, please say something else? Please. This goes to everybody, just to let you all know. The whole first, second comments, I delete those immediately because they're a waste of space. They contribute nothing to the conversation. Contribute to the conversation. Say something about the video. Say something about the topic. Nobody cares who was first, second, like, comment, whatever. Nobody cares. Probably not even you. <laughs> so just actually be a productive member of the community and contribute to the conversation. Please, thank you. I would very much appreciate it. <sighs> Any inspiration story? Any inspiration story? I don't know. Stories of inspiration. Once there was a man who needed inspiration. And he looked to the gods. He said, gods, give me inspiration. The gods said, you don't need inspiration. You are inspiration. That made no sense whatsoever. I just made that up. Okay. Well, <laughs> Magnus. Magnus. Hey, I'm Go. Will you will you be review TF Prime toys from APC Toys? Um, the only one I've reviewed was the Black Arachnia. I mean, not Black Arachnia. I wanted to call her Black Arachnia so bad. The Arachnid. The only one I've reviewed is the Arachnid they put out, and that's the only one so far that has interested me in any way whatsoever. The rest of them, I don't really care about. Uh, Christina. Where and when did you find Mascot? Well, the story of Mascot is uh, basically the origin story of Mascot is I, uh, I was when I started this channel, I wanted something to basically stand in for me. I wanted something to be like my representative on camera. Um, so I was just looking around for just whatever weird looking toy, something that would pique my interest that could, you know, stand in for me. And I was in Toys R Us, and I was in the uh, Bionicle section, and I saw this guy here. And I was like, hey, he looks pretty cool. He's red and black, right colors. So I was like, you know what, buddy? You get the job. And he got the job, and he has been here ever since. As they say, the rest is history. And, um, yeah, he's been my sidekick from day one, and he will be my sidekick to the day this channel dies. I'll probably ask to uh, when I, when when I die, I'll probably put it in my uh, in my will to be buried with him. <laughs> I want him in the coffin with me. <laughs> we rode together. We're gonna die together. <laughs> no channel. Can I have your TF collection? Sure, take it. Go ahead. You can have it. Have it all. Uh, what is your most expensive figure? Uh, it would. It would definitely be the uh, Robosen Optimus Prime. He was what? Like 800 bucks? Yeah. He was the most expensive. Uh, Magnus, uh, what are your thoughts on Rise of the Beast? Um, it looks cool. The trailer looks awesome. I loved everything that I saw. My body is ready for it. 
uh, system, system, system zero. Will you finish the reviews for the Archcore Arc Combiner? I will. I do have. I do have the other wolf. I do have the trailer. Um, it's just the point of finding the opening to do those reviews, and that's the thing. It's just like anytime I'm close to being able to do it, something else comes in that takes priority and that pushes everything back. So it's just a case of you know. It, it just happens. It just happens. I, I, I can't do everything at the same time. So it's just things take priority, which means other things get pushed back. And it's just, I'll get to it eventually when I don't know. Ultra Spider-Man. Are you a Marvel fan? Yes, I'm a Marvel fan. I'm a DC fan. I love it all. Sad Gamer. I'll stop saying first every video. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Mike, how do you send fan mail? Uh, you don't. I don't have any. Um, I don't have a P.O. box or anything, so that's not really an option right now. But it's okay. You guys don't have to send me stuff. That's not That's not necessary. Just you watching the videos and supporting what I do is all the gift I need from you guys, man. Just your positive vibes and your support is all I need. That is all the gift I will ever need from you guys. Uh, Lightning Storm, would you do a live review? I've done a couple live reviews already. Um, I've, I've done a couple. I don't do them very often, but I have done a couple live reviews already. Uh, Leo, Leo, what are your thoughts on Wheeljack's head design from Rise of the Beast? I mean, I have no problem with it. Um, I mean, it is kind of, it, it is a little bit of a kind of, I don't know if they're going to explain it because in the Bumblebee movie, if if Rise of the Beast is a continuation of the Bumblebee movie, then they need to explain why, Wheel, why Wheeljack looks completely different now, why he has a totally different head. Because in the Bumblebee movie, he looked like Wheeljack and now he doesn't look like Wheeljack. So I don't know if they're going to explain that. We'll see what happens. But I have no problem with it. <laughs> Keith, it's cool to see Megs and Shockwave back on the magic sofa. They never left the sofa. They've always there. That's this is literally how I have them displayed on my shelf. They're sitting on the couch. They're always sitting on the couch. So it's just become their permanent state of being <laughs> is them on the couch. <laughs> Oh man, who is this? Arc Ar I'm gonna butcher your name. I'm so sorry. Eight Industries. I'll just say that, that part because I know how to pronounce it. I hope you're staying warm in your studio, Engo, and so is everyone else where you are. Yeah, it's it, it's actually not too bad down here. Usually it's freezing down here, but um, actually today it doesn't feel that bad down here. Probably because I'm not focused on it. I'm just doing other things. So I'll probably since probably since I'm distracted, I'm not noticing that it's cold. <laughs> The Black Hero, can I have your basement? Please take it. As long as you have a bigger one to exchange it for, you can have it. Uh, you mean just the basement, right? I mean, not the stuff in it. Like, I'm keeping the stuff, but if you just want to exchange basements, yes. If you have a bigger basement, I'll take yours. You can have this one. <laughs> you can move right in, buddy. Oh, man. What are your thoughts about 2023 Transformers figure? That's a very broad question. Um, I mean, I'm looking forward to what's coming out in 2023. Obviously, we got more studio series stuff coming out, more mainline stuff. We got new movie stuff coming out. That's exciting. So I'm looking forward to it all. Carson, what's your favorite Galvatron your favorite Galvatron figure mainline or third party? Um, I would say the fans toys. Uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Try that again. The fans toys Galvatron is definitely one of my favorites. I love the movie Galvatron that unique toys put out. I love that one. I think they did a great job with that. 
Magnus, um, have you played Metal Gear Rising? I have not. I played a Metal Gear Solid game a long... I've only played one Metal Gear Solid game, and that was a long time ago, and I don't remember which one it was. But I remember the ending being like an hour long. It was like a long ending. <laughs> I didn't mind. I was like, cool. For all that work, it's good to get a long ending. Um, but yeah, I don't remember which which game it was specifically. But I did play a Metal Gear Solid game a long time ago. It's the only one I played. But it was good, though. It was good. <laughs> Mick Marty, if G1 is about pizza, bagels versus burritos, is Beast Wars about bananas and plantains? Eh, kinda. Kinda, kinda. Zero one, did I miss the build already? Yeah, you missed the build. We got done. We got done this in like half an hour. This <laughs> this took no time really. <laughs> but here it is. I'll show you. We got a little Santa Claus here. We built Santa. He's skiing. He's got a sack of presents. So good. He's ready. He's happy. He's feeling it. In our Christmas train. I'll bring it down here. There you go. Our Christmas train. Wee, the Christmas train. There we go. That's what we built. Enjoyable little builds. Found those at Target. Stay hydrated. We must exactly stay hydrated, ladies and gentlemen. Stay hydrated. Ah, uh, uh, just imagine if Transformers didn't exist. What would you do now? Oh, God. That's a good question. That's a good question. I don't know. I don't know. Would I still be doing this and just reviewing other toys? Maybe. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. That's a good question, though. Oh, Jay Say Henny. Hey, MGO, Shadow Pines here just caught you. Also, MGO, I just got American Truck Simulator and I made Optimus Prime in the game. G1 Optimus, mind you, along with his trailer, too. Cool, 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 cool. Water is MGO's Energon. Exactly, exactly. That's everybody's Energon, really. When you think about it. You can use Coronation Starscream's Throne for Mascot's talk show. Yeah, I mean, that's an option. That's an option. Do you like Mirage better as a sports car, a Porsche, or an Indy car? Mirage, um, hmm. I don't know. I mean, like, I, I get like my brain instantly goes to, yeah, the Indy car, just because you know that's old school. But I like, I like the, I like the Porsche. I'm not, I'm not mad at the Porsche. It looks cool. Carson, what was your first review ever? My first review ever was of the uh, Robots in the Skies Optimus Prime. The Robots in the in the Skies from. 2000, not current. There have been way more robots in disguise since then, but the original robots in disguise line. Cat Jazz, more Voltron? I don't know. Yeah. Maybe more Voltron. I don't know. Well, that, actually, probably not because they don't make a lot of Voltron merch. So that would be a well that would dry up really quick, honestly. Um, do you still have that prime? Which prime? Which one do you know? I have a lot of primes. Which one specifically are you talking about? That's a very broad question. Do you still have that prime of the five million you've reviewed? Do you have a favorite video that you've made? Uh, yeah, dude, where's my couch? Dude, where's my couch? I think is probably my favorite thing that I've done. <clears throat> have you checked out the Beast Wars Monopoly game? Yeah, yeah, I did see it. 
Uh, Des Desina, I'm sorry if I'm butchering your name. Why don't you buy the Black Mamba KO Optimus Primes? Because I didn't want it. I got the um, I I got the the uh, the the Wei Zhang one, and I felt that was all I needed. I was happy with it. I was like, I don't need to get any more. <laughs> I don't need to buy the same mold, you know, 50 times. It's like I'm good. I got I I I bought a couple of versions of the original MPM mold. I got the black, uh, not the black mold. I'm sorry. I got the uh, Wei Zhang one, and I was like, I'm good. I don't need to buy any more of this. <clears throat> Can you bring on MP10? MP10 is in retirement. He is in retirement in a closet, so I can't get him out right now. Uh, what is your first transformer? I have no idea. I don't remember. I that's a long time ago. I don't remember what my first transformer was. Any recommendations of of Nemesis Prime? Yeah, don't buy Nemesis Prime. He's a pointless character. Don't buy Nemesis Prime. <laughs> American Slayer. Hello to you, Mr. American Slayer. Oh man. Do you remember any flash animations from back in the day? I mean, yeah. There used to be a lot of those on the internet. Are you getting the upgrade kit for Studio Series 54 Megatron? Yeah, yeah, I have it pre ordered. I'm assuming you mean the. Uh, the uh, DNA one. Oh, American Slayer, thank you for assistance with uh, Shozy's story. You're welcome. Jasper, out of everything released, which would you like to see get an upgrade kit? Again, that's a very broad question. That's a lot. That's that's a lot to mentally go over. That I don't know. I don't know. I I can't answer that question because that's a that's a lot of stuff to mentally catalog. What was your favorite flash animation from back in the day? I don't I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember. Favorite copywriter belt jingles. Oh god, the favorites questions are always very hard for me. Um Uh, I did like, I liked, I liked Gio's, um, the Grand Gio, Grand Gio, I liked the Grand Gio, uh, jingle just because it was pretty much like a whole musical number and I love that. So <laughs> I will say that. Where do you get replacement parts? Um, uh, I mean, most of the time. <laughs> Oh, excuse me. Uh, most of the time, when I say I'm going to get a replacement for something, it usually just means I'm going to buy a whole new figure. <laughs> That's usually what that means. Oh, I'm going to get a replacement part for that. It usually means I'm just buying a whole new figure. <clears throat> but Prime! I think we should make Dude Where's My Couch a Christmas tradition. I think so. I think we should watch Dude Where's My Couch every year. It should be like it should be our version of a Christmas story. Just have it running for 24 hours. <laughs> uh, how much do you think you've spent on all your TF figs, KOs included? Oh, God. Uh, too much. Way, way, way too much. Magnus, uh, what are your plans when you reach 1 million? Pfft, I mean, first of all, don't even know if that will actually happen. If it does, I have no idea what I'll do for that. How can you never review the uh, Master Made Power Master Prime? Uh, the Master Made Power Master, honestly, because I was just going through like Power Master Prime fatigue, because it seemed like every company was putting out a Power Master Prime. So honestly, I was just kind of over Power Master Prime. 
that's why I didn't get it. Um, they have a Devastator too that I still haven't even bought. So I, I don't know. I love their stuff. Don't get me wrong. It's just this stuff I haven't gotten around. I don't know if I'll get their Power Master Prime. I'll probably get their Devastator eventually. Destacina was the quote you don't stop playing uh, your original or like inspired from somewhere? Uh, no, the you, uh, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. That is a quote from George Bernard Shaw. That is his quote, not mine. And uh, I just, I adopted it. <laughs> I adopted it because it's just wonderful words of wisdom, really. It's just wonderful words of wisdom. So I wanted to impart that. Upon the world. Pyro Kid, hello to you in Germany. Hello to you in Germany. Ever have an expectation, ever have high expectations for an official figure, but, but was disappointed once you got it? Um... No, because I don't I don't have high expectations for anything. I don't I don't do that because when you go into something with high expectations, you're always disappointed. So I don't do that. <laughs> Whenever I see something that piques my interest, I put down the pre-order and I'm just like, okay, let's see how this goes. That's pretty much how I go into anything is I just open up the box and I'm like, all right, let's see how this works out. Maybe it'll work, maybe it won't, but we'll see how it goes. But I never go into anything with any pre preconceived notions or expectations because when you do that, you're always going to be disappointed. Great legacy Tarn on a scale from 1 to 10. Frostbite loves Tarn, can you tell? Uh, on a scale of one to ten, I will give Tarn a solid nine. The only reason I'm deducting points, the deducting the, the, the only reason I'm deducting that one point is because I wish his hands flipped in. Other than that, I'll give him a solid nine because he's solid, everything is covered up, he doesn't have any gaps. So I will give him a solid nine. If his hands flipped in, perfect ten. <clears throat> Big John, I finally had to buy a new L Sid. Why? Because he fell apart because that thing is not good. <laughs> Why would you buy a new one? There are so many better versions that are on the market right now. Buy the Unique Toys version. Buy the KO of the Unique Toys version. That one's way better too. What about rolling wheels? I mean, I don't care about the rolling wheels. That's not a deal breaker for me. So that's like, whatever. I just found it amusing that they just like molded in wheels. And that's obviously just to kind of keep it off the ground. So when you're sliding him around, you're not actually sliding the figure. You know, you're not scratching the figure up. So that's just to keep it off the ground. But I just found it amusing that they actually just like molded little wheels on them. But I get why they did it. Because it keeps you from scratching up the figure if you want to slide him around. But that, that wasn't a deal breaker. Like, I'm not deducting points for that because I get why they did it. Black Hero, where did you get where did you get tan the sun? What are you talking about? You mean me? My tan? I mean, I'm just naturally tan. I mean, I'm Puerto Rican, so I'm naturally tan. So <laughs> American Slayer, I just got uh gigawatts or gigawatts, depending on how you want to say it. I love the vehicle mode, not a fan of the robot mode. Okay. Uh, Jace Henny. Uh, I also made Nemesis Prime and Motormaster in the American Truck Sims as well. Oh, cool, 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 cool.
Oh, Fly McMarty, I was going to tell you a joke about money, but it made no sense. <laughs> Thoughts on Ultra Mag Magnus? Thoughts on Ultra Magnus? He's swell. He is swell. He is swell. Oh, man. All right, you know what, guys? We're going to call it. We're going to call it because I'm tired. My throat is starting to hurt. I need to go. I have other things to do. <laughs> but it's been real. It's been fun. We built us a little Santa Claus. There we go. Hey, Santa. Hey, Santa on his skis. We built us our little Christmas train. These will be displayed upstairs with the other Christmas stuff. And, uh, yeah, we're going to call it probably next week. We'll build another uh, another Star Trek ship. We'll probably do that next week. But we took a break because it's Christmas. We wanted to, we wanted to do something Christmassy. So, as always, hope you enjoyed the build. I hope you enjoyed the conversation. We'll be here next week. Same time, same channel. And, uh, as always... I hope you enjoy your day. I hope you enjoy your weekend. And I, I can't I can't talk anymore. This is definitely why we need to go because my brain is shutting off as we speak. I really need to go. <laughs> so as always, I hope you enjoy your day, enjoy your weekend. But of course, have a Merry Christmas. Have a Happy New Year. Have a happy whatever you celebrate this time of year. If you don't celebrate anything, have a happy Sunday. So there you go. As always, be well. God bless. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. And as always, remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Be a geek. Be proud. Merry Christmas and palm in your face.